they had information about the vessel that was leaving one of these water taxis that was leaving um, Corozal and out to San Pedro and about the contents on the boat. So we uh, we conducted a search and it uh, just immediately um, uh, to, to the boarding of passengers so that we could not have confused uh, what passengers brought on with what was in fact on the boat already. <coughs> and it turned up uh, uh, five different packages with compressed marijuana hydrotype, uh, four small packages and a bigger one. And they all uh, weighed in a total of 4.4 ounces of compressed marijuana. These um, drugs, when shown to the captain of the boat, uh, were readily owned up to by him. He accepted that they were his and that, in fact, you know, he accepted responsibility for the offense committed. He was taken to court yesterday in Corozal where he pled guilty. And he was signed there and given time to pay. Uh, during that operation, we similarly uh, found uh, a number of or uh, bottles bottles of liquors that were suspected to be contraband, and they were never owned up to by anybody, of course, and so they were confiscated and will be handed over to the customs department. On Monday. Is he known as a drug peddler? In information is showing that he's a drug peddler? I don't have any information about his fire activities except that we were, uh, <clears throat> by virtue of intelligence, led to what was on the boat. Turned out that he was the captain, but I don't know that. I don't know him. To, to, I don't know anything about him prior to yesterday.